Hi, I'm Malcolm, the developer of SP Remap, an app to remap the hardware buttons on your Samsung Galaxy Watch running Wear OS. I've recently added some new features, so I'm going to walk through them today. A reminder that SP Remap isn't on the Google Play Store since it uses accessibility features. In my previous video, I showed how to install SP Remap on your watch, and I've included a link to that video in the notes below. So let's open SP Remap on my Samsung Galaxy Watch 4 here and take a look. Now lots of people have been asking me to add support to remap the middle button on the new Galaxy Watch Ultra. I don't have that watch myself, but I know that you can currently set the middle button action to be Samsung Health, Stopwatch, Flashlight or Waterlock. So this version of SP Remap can override the stopwatch to allow any other app to be opened instead. That's in addition to remapping Bixby on the top button and Samsung Pay on the bottom button. And that's all explained in the notes here. Let's tap the next button and we'll be asked to give accessibility permission. So let's go to installed apps and SP Remap, turn it on. Yes, I'm sure. And right swipe until we're back in the, uh, in the app. Now this time we'll tap on next and we're presented with a carousel of all of the installed apps and we can start allocating them to the hardware buttons. If at any point we want to go back to the default apps, just tap unset. But let's start with the bottom button, which, as you know, is normally Samsung Pay. Most people probably would remap that to Google Wallet. And so we get a message to say that's done. Now, uh, remember, we are simulating that we've got a Samsung Watch Ultra. Uh, assuming that we had, we can override stopwatch. And let's choose let's say calculator little button map to calculator and finally we can remap the top button which is normally Bixby and let's remap that to music we'll long tap top button mapped to music so now let's test it out long tap the bottom button And we're at Google Pay. Let's long tap the top button. And we're at music. And we don't have a middle button on this watch, obviously, but we can simulate that by choosing stopwatch from the app list. This is what would happen if we tapped, long tap the middle button on the Watch Ultra. And as expected, we go to Calculator, which was the app we selected. Now, if we right tap, right swipe to, uh, to end the, uh, the app, we can see that Stopwatch is still there in the background. It just takes us straight back to Calculator. That's obviously not great. So let's fix that by going back into SP Remap. And if we keep scrolling down, we'll see there are options for each button to send a back command. And remember, we're pretending we've got a Watch Ultra. Let's send the back command on the middle button. And then go back into Stopwatch. And this time, because we sent the back command, when we right swipe, it goes back to the watch face, which is what we want. So you can find SP Remap along with my other free apps at my Freepot website, and I've included a link in the notes below this video. That's about it for now. Thanks for watching and see you again soon.